What's up, BP Squad? It's Fence Crosby back with another video. Today, guys, we're gonna be going through a 20 minute beginner flexibility routine. Now, you will not need any equipment for today's routine. We're gonna be stretching from head to toe, making sure to relieve some of that stress and help you guys recover better. All right, guys, without further ado, let's go ahead and start today's routine. Now, the first stretch we have is gonna be a neck stretch. We're gonna be stretching our neck for three different exercises. We're gonna be doing all of these neck stretches from the kneeling position. So stretching out our ankles, our shins, and of course our quads. If you feel a little uncomfortable, feel free to prompt yourself up and proceed from there. Last couple of seconds, guys. What we're gonna do, turn our neck up and down. Exhale, inhale, up and down. Feel that stretch on your neck. You get really stiff around these areas. All right, guys, now we have a static stretch. So I'm gonna be stretching out the left side of my neck. I'm gonna take my left arm, bring it around, grab my head with my right hand. From here, I'm gonna keep my chest big, keep my left shoulder down. Really pull on your head, but be gentle, guys. Don't be so hard. Control your breathing. Great job, guys. All right, guys, making a switch to the other side. Right hand behind, grabbing my head with my left. Started a little early. This is where I feel the most tight. Generally in my upper traps, my neck. I'm gonna stop talking guys, let's go ahead and get this stretch in. job guys now we're gonna take our hands in front of us bring it around we'll stretch out our chest and our shoulders I'll show you from this angle right here so having your hands made into a fist makes it easier too easy for you guys go ahead and put your hands in that prayer position Keep your chest big Make sure you guys relax. That's the key to improving your flexibility is to relax and breathe through the stretch. Great job, guys. Now we have the cat-cow position. So we're stretching out our back. From here, guys, we're gonna that dip, we're gonna inhale up. Big back, guys. Exhale down. <sighs> inhale up. And exhale, guys. <sighs> Great job. Last one, guys. Inhale up. And exhale. Now we're gonna be stre stretching out our chest. Taking my left arm, putting it at a 45 degree angle, guys, because we're stretching out our left side first. We're gonna turn. We're thinking about the side we're stretching, try to drive it into the ground. The more you turn out like this, the more you get a greater stretch in your chest and in your shoulders. Great job, guys. Go ahead and make that switch to the other side.
taking my right arm, 45 degrees. You can play with the angle as well. You don't have to have your arm at 45 degrees. You just gotta find that sweet spot. This side is a little bit tighter for me. Two years without stretching my upper body, guys, is ridiculous. That's what I did to myself. And definitely now recovering since I've been pretty consistent. I tell you guys, stay consistent with stretching. Great job, guys. Now we have butcher's block stretch. We're gonna be stretching out our chest. Well, mainly our triceps and our lats. Get a little bit of stretch in your, in your chest as well. Taking your hands in that prayer position. Drive your elbows into the ground, guys. Great job, guys. Now we have lunge position stretch. So we're in that lunge position, guys. What we're gonna do, We'll start off with our right side first. You're gonna turn your right foot onto his side. You're gonna turn towards the side you're stretching, guys. You'll feel a stretch in your hip flexors, quads, low back, and your adductor muscles. seconds guys all right now we have a couch stretch we're gonna be stretching out our quads except we're gonna be doing our left side if you were just stretching out your right side bring that heel to your bunda seconds all right now we're gonna be stretching our hamstrings right side we're gonna now have that leg gonna kick it out or should I say kick it forward stretching out our hamstrings guys Again, make sure you are relaxed as much as possible. Breathe through. Feel free to get deeper in a stretch if you would like to. All right, guys, swinging around to the other side. What we're gonna do now is do that lunge position stretch. Again, what I like about this stretch is really, I feel it in my adductors a lot, which get really tight if you sit do a lot of jogging, they get really tight and weak, so this is a good stretch right here. We're also stretching out the glutes, of course. Get bigger in the stretch if you want a little more stress at you. Great job, guys. Now, of course, we're gonna be stretching out our right quad. Or, other way, if you already did this side. This side is a little bit tighter for me.
feels great. Now we're stretching out our hamstrings. I'll make this a little bit more challenging. Try to get in that split, but not totally in that split. This is great for me right now. Great job, guys. Now we have deep squat with a twist. So we're in that deep squat position, guys. What we're gonna do, we're gonna stretch out our left side first. Just gonna open up. Exhale down, inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale up. Whew. All right, guys, making that switch to the other side. really open up that spine. That's what I love about this stretch. Try to keep your chest big too. Great job, guys. Now, one of my favorite stretches to do, and that's a straddle position stretch. We're gonna be working on our sides. Go as far as you can to one side. If you're right here, guys, and you can't even get close, just try to hold it like this. Relax. Making that switch. Say for instance that you're like this and it's hard for you to get deeper. Just go like this guys and try to open up just very slightly. Just try to keep your chest open as much as you can. Ooh, great job. Now we have the pancake stretch. So stretching out our hammies and our lower back. With this though, guys, I want you guys to aim to keep your back straight. So don't hunch over, don't try to round your back. Try to keep it nice and straight. Go as deep as your body allows. If you're doing this with a partner, have them grab your hands and kind of pull and make sure you just relax into it. Great job, guys. Now we have 90-90 glute stretch. So we're gonna start off with our left side first. Body's at 90 degrees, or should I say your legs? Gonna bend as comfortable as you can and hold this stretch guys try to keep your torso square don't angle it like this yet just try to keep it square as possible go as deep as you can
All right, now we're gonna be stretching out our piriformis. So that's connected to your glutes. What we're gonna do is just turn our torso and we're now we're gonna try to angle ourselves over our foot. Go as deep as you can. Switching to the other side. <sighs> this is my tighter one for sure. Try to stay relaxed, guys. Don't tense up. All right, now we're stretching our piriformis on our right side. Get ready, guys. Try to keep your chest as close to your foot as possible. Great job, guys. Now we have seated hamstring stretch. Again, we're gonna try to prevent our back from rounding so much. Try to keep it straight as possible. Thing about being in nature, get all type of insects on you. Relax, guys. All right, stretching out our shoulders. We have a reverse plank or tabletop. So either one you choose is up to you guys. The reverse plank, you're gonna make sure that Turn your fingers out, drive away, or you can do the tabletop, have your feet on the ground. Really feel that stretch in your shoulders. We're working on shoulder extension. Play with it like this as well. Moving on guys, now we have the butterfly stretch. Think about keeping your chest big guys. Knees into the ground. As close as you can. Really stretching out our growing now. All right, guys, now we have a dynamic deep squat. So we'll be back into that deep squat again. Now we're gonna be shifting back and forth. Also, open one side, open both sides. Keep your chest as big as you can. 
our last one, guys. Just wind it down. All right, guys. So, great job. That was our 20-minute beginner flexibility routine. As I said, guys, we stretched from head to toe, taking it nice and slow. We spent 30 seconds into each pose. So that's pretty much a sweet spot. Definitely in the future videos, as we get a little bit more advanced, a little more comfortable, I should say, uh, we're gonna be stretching for 45 seconds. So I might have a deep stretching routine that's gonna be coming out within another month or so. So be on the lookout for that one. That one probably won't be, actually might be 15 to 20 minutes as well. Might be a nice one to do before you go to bed or the first thing you rise, the first thing you do when you rise up. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, you know what to do guys. Make sure you smash that like button. Most importantly, make sure you are properly subscribed. I'll see you guys next Thursday, 10 a.m. Eastern time. Peace and love as always. And I shave. Boom, we out baby.